All right, I'm gonna take it real slow. Like actually, this is this is this is actually bullshit. Hey, what is going on guys? It is Lachlan here and welcome back to a brand new episode of the Ark Survival Series. So, we've got a lot to go through this episode. The start to our fantastic house has begun for the Blue Banter Boys. Uh, Mr. Miola has started the construction and we're going to be continuing it. It's going to be like a Frankenstein house, mansion, headquarters. We don't really know what we're going to call it at this stage, but we're all going to contribute. He's already got the foundations going. I was uh, in a bit of a Skype call with him. I don't think you can see it. Actually, yeah, you can see the start of it right there in the middle. It's like, yeah, there it is, right there. There you go, you see it. That's the start of it. And uh, should be kind of, you know, awesome to finally have a nice, um, constructive and cool place to build and have friends over. Yeah, that's it. So yeah, before I recorded this episode, I did a lot of, um, I did a huge, Huge grind. I went ahead and uh, visited the uh, the volcano that was uh, very far away. I brought the Quetzal and I think four of the other Argies with me. And uh, pretty much just used them to carry back a crap ton of metal, obsidian, and all that jazz. So I've gone ahead and smelted most of it up right now. Um, I think I got a huge run. I'm still smelting the rest of it down because I found more of it left behind. But uh, if you look over here, we've got uh, just a few pieces of obsidian. And and there's more down the bottom as well. It's actually another raw piece of metal I need to go and smelt. So let's chuck that in the smeltery. But we were actually considering making the house or headquarters out of metal. And I was like, nah, we should probably not do that. Because that's going to require, like, so much. I don't know how much it is per piece. But I might trim it with a little piece of metal in there. I don't know. We've got a lot here. Um, I don't think we can make anything out of obsidian. Or at least at this stage. But, uh, yeah, we've got tons of obsidian there. Tons of flint as well for arrows and other things. Uh. Uh, I'm going to take all the stone with me because we're primarily building it out of stone and uh, thatch for the wood floor as well. Of course, it's always good to bring back as many materials as I can. So yeah, there's 200 metal ingots, 189, a lot smelting over there. Plus, I think Matt used a few of them. Stocked out some, some crystals as well, so... That's cool, and uh, yeah, just all that nice little fresh stock. I spent like an hour getting this yesterday, all of the, um... All the obsidian. That, that run took so long. I even waited. Like, obsidian was spawning me. I was there that long in that volcano. Like, it was... It was a session and a half. Alright, so while this is smelting, let's go ahead and get started. And uh, have a look at what we're working with over here. Now, I don't know if he's put any... Or he being Miola. I think he's pretty much put down everything that he's got. Uh, but this is what we're working with. And the whole design that we're going to, um, I guess, uh, go for or aim for is hopefully going to get uh, some more ramps here so we can all ramp up. I, yeah, because like right here... Oh, you don't actually need a ramp there. Uh, maybe we might... I think we'll do it just for the sake of... Having it evened out, but yeah, like you don't even need a, re a ramp here, but it just looks better. Um, so nice railings here, stone railings. And then in here, you're probably wondering why there's all these uh, supports with uh, thatch ceilings. Now, that's just because uh, he wanted to have a nice even floor so that he would uh, bring it off the ground because the ground's uneven AF and uh, use these bad boys. And then you know how they actually stick out of the top? Um, like um, we witnessed on top of our crow's nest attempt. Um, apparently, if you just put a stone ceiling on top of that, then it'll just get rid of it and you can clear it out. So we're going to be making a lot of ceilings, and hopefully we can just get the ceiling laid out for today's episode. Maybe get some stone walls up as well. And uh, yeah, hopefully it'll be a nice constructive episode. Maybe get a level off of it as well. And also, apparently, there is a second exit to the cave me and Vic visited yesterday. Um, so I want to, I guess apologize for what happened um very unfortunate but uh yeah I, I don't i don't know of a place that there i, I didn't i didn't know i i just didn't know that that's it i didn't know i didn't know that there was a uh, another exit so if anyone would like to show me someone sent me some tweets or something because i looked at the cave on the wiki and it didn't come up at all so yeah, would appreciate that for sure. Um, but yeah, I'm going to grab... I'm probably going to need to grab more thatch, actually. Uh, what am I running low on to make these? Probably fiber, maybe? I'm not too sure. Because I want to try and get all the uh, the first layer of roofs and um, wooden supports up as well. Pillars, if you will. So I actually need wood for those as well. So I'll go ahead and do a quick chop sesh. Uh, looks like the sun is either rising or falling, but I think it is falling. 
No. All right, quick deforestation session. You know how it is. And uh, damn, I really hate it that I've just started this video. I mean, I'm going to have uh, dinner in a short while and uh, take a break from recording in and out. But like, it just sucks because I really wanted to record. Like, I hate recording at nighttime in ARG. It's just a pet peeve of mine. I hate it. It's just so bad. All right, so let's start pacing uh, some of these down over here. So these are thatched ceilings that have to be in line with all that. And uh, like I said, that's just the first layer of our house. Let's get some more of those built. And uh, I don't know if I'm going to have to chuck some more support pillars down. I probably am going to have to build some. Uh, let's see how far we can get without having to build one. I feel like on this next one, it's probably going to want me to place... No? Alright, that's fine. I mean, if we really want to get some more pillars... I feel like there's a pillar right here going to be needed. No. Must be adequate amounts of support that doesn't need it anymore. Alright, perfect. Oh, whoops, that... See, I gotta be careful here. I gotta be careful. I just messed up there. I just messed up. Okay, they gotta be in line, because that's the next layer that the other one's gonna be on. Alright, so there is where we want it. Alright, there we go. No messing up now. And I get one more as well on top of that. Yep, perfect. And that'll be the full thatch like cover, I guess you could say. Um, so that's nice and dandy. Perfect. Okay, now we're gonna start. Um, yeah, now we're gonna start with the stone ceiling. So pretty much done or oh, is it yeah no this is all that so yeah if we get the stone ceiling in i, I want to try and do something cool with the middle i might get like a metal ceiling or something um for that just to give it a nice little trim or something i don't know maybe get some trims down the side maybe even wood uh, i don't know or maybe, oh, i can paint it i'll paint it blue we'll probably just end up painting it because holy fudge is metal looking expensive all right here comes the big part the stone ceilings it is 60 stone a ceiling and this is like the hardest part about a big build especially within this like minecraft you get your blocks there's no weight restrictions none of that but over here boy are there some restrictions and then and then some like it's crazy man um but we're gonna try and build as many as we can hopefully it'll make us lighter in the process as well uh craft item and i think we can craft that many that's uh we, we need a lot more i think it's uh, the other resource we're running out of yeah wood we need more wood on us okay we're gonna have to do a wood stock up uh we just did one but we need to do it again now that that's great i love that and it's gone full night time so hit them with a gamma and we are good to go all right, so yeah, I'm trying to show you what I was talking about before. See if I put the second layer on, completely covers up that wooden support and uh, no longer looks ugly. So yeah, easy bangers. I'm going to get rid of those first because they are the, the ugliest, ugliest things. All right, so let's have a look. How much stone do we got? We got a decent amount of stone here. Um, I'm just going to... Uh, I'm trying to think how I want to do this so that i can still do that little trim thing that i was thinking about Alrighty, we're back at it again with the white vans uh now it's daytime now a lot of time has passed uh, on the server since i uh stopped recording i went ahead had dinner had bacon and eggs for dinner um dad went ahead and cooked them up for me because i was busy playing arc obviously um no there was no food in the house and uh, he was like yeah i just got bacon and eggs he made us for it so yeah, it was lit. Cheers, Dad. You're the best. Anyway, while I was uh, eating and whatnot, I was still playing a little bit. As you can see, I've leveled up. And I'm going to go ahead and apply that to... I'm going to apply it to weight because it, uh, it, you know, hits close to home on what we're trying to accomplish lately, which is to get building and carrying so much resources at once is, uh, is kind of intense. So I've got some more uh, ceilings to go ahead and place down here. Uh, I want to give you the outer ones first, like I said. Now, what happened here? Did I mess this up? Oh, I must have replaced it. Um, hmm. I must have replaced it. Or did I just skim across the top there? It's a little it's a little uneven, don't you think, Mr. Miola? Just a little bit uneven. But either way, that is fine. Okay, so let's go ahead and fill in all these gaps. Like I said, if I'm going to do any kind of, like, cool trim, I'll do it in the middle. Should be careful while placing these. I don't want to mess that up again. Um, so, yeah, let's work from the outer, you know, corners and work work inwards, all right? Let's work inwards here. So let's go seven. Why is it letting me place it down? Why is there a problem here? Officer, do we have a problem? All right, so yeah, let's get these outer edges done. Like I said, I just want to work on these ones first. Why is it being a jag? It's like, it's, 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 it was, it was all fine and dandy. Oh, I did it again. I misclicked. All right, none of that again. Arc uh, building isn't exactly the cleanest. Uh... Okay, come on now. This is getting ridiculous. All right, it's actually getting ridiculous. I've just wasted like so many on failed attempts. I do have some more ceilings in here, 12 more exactly. Plus I've got some stone walls I'm going to start placing down as well. And then I'll probably just go in and out of the jungle. Uh, in and out of the jungle. This little thing up here, it's actually really good for stone and wood. Like just in and out, there's a lot of stone, uh, like, you know, you know, resources that you can just grab. Like little stone mounds, hit them with an axe, get a good amount. Also, 
Okay, this is actually starting to low-key piss me off. Like, actually low-key piss me off right now. Alright, I'm gonna take it real slow. Like, actually? This is, this is, this is actually bullshit. Okay. Th it says it's on top. That's on top. Alright, alright. Okay. That's on top. Okay, I think I got a system here now. That's on top. If I tell it that's on top, like, if I verbally say that's on top, it doesn't, it doesn't get it wrong ever. So, we're good now. And last but not least. So, I thought I didn't actually need to make any more uh, ceilings. I thought I had too many, but no. I need a lot more of these things. But it's coming along. It, it's getting there. I mean, yeah, it's actually, the progress is there. And that's the thing. Uh, uh, like, every episode, me and Miola are just going to chip at this. Hopefully, Vic will come in as well. Um, although, I don't think Vic does daily arcs, so it's kind of harder for him to, you know, contribute. But at least he'll have his own room, so. Yeah. Uh, how do I... Come on. Stop doing this! It's so annoying! Look at that. It'll do it there, but it won't do it here. Oh, well, there we go. Perfect. Okay. So, almost got all the outer rings uh, covered. It's it's getting there. It's getting there. Now, let's do the walls. Let's get those walls. I got 18 of them total. Let's go ahead and just go all the way around now that we've got pretty much all the walls. Uh, okay, this, this whole... It's, it's exactly like building on Stranded Deep. Like, it just snaps on and it just appears. I actually kind of like that, like, design and style of building... Um, but not when they're, they're very resource intensive. The stone pieces actually aren't too bad. The wood ones are horrible. Like, the wood's actually worse to try and, like, get. Because just plain wood. It's just so much of it at once. Oh, that's going to be bad. Oh. Yeah. I, oh, because I don't have a thing on it yet. Okay, let's just destroy that. Let's just destroy that. Yeah, demolish wall. Alright. That's the one thing. We, we need one more ceiling for that. If I didn't mess those up... I would probably have enough for it as well. Um, let me just get some more ceilings as well. It looks like I'm going to need so many more of these things. Uh, let's just chuck the crafting recipe as that one right there. Uh, why can't I actually make more of these? What do I need to make more of these? Like, surely I gathered enough from the failed builds. Oh, I didn't actually... They weren't failed because I had to get rid of them. Uh, I need stone and 10 more pieces of it. That's fine. Looks like I'm going to need a pillar closer to it to actually get it. But he's got these evenly... Oh, they're not even. They're, they're not even. Okay, that's fine. We can go ahead and do that. Uh, what kind of pillar can we make right off the top of our head? Uh, he's going wood, so I'll go wood as well. And hopefully just chucking this in under here will be enough. All right, use item. And hopefully I can get it just chucked right there. Oh, it's going to go through the top, isn't it? Ugh. No, it's, we can't have it like that. And I was meant to do this episode with Matt, like, when we were starting it out, but time zones didn't exactly work out for me, because I'm running this, like, half-American schedule here. Alright, I'm thinking there should poke just through the top, but not too much. Please don't poke through the second layer, I beg the scene. It looks like we're good, it looks like we're good. And can we now place a wall down, please tell me. <gasps> yeah, baby, there we go, alrighty. Perfect, okay. Problem solved. And I'll put the rest of these walls down, because they, you know, you know, they carry a lot of weight, and I want to get some building done. Well, one more. Just snap, damn it. All right, eight and done. All righty. So hopefully by the end of this episode, what I'm hoping I would have accomplished uh, as far as resources go is uh, walls all the way around. I, oh, geez, this is a really big room. Uh, so like I said at the start, the way this is going to be envisioned is they're going to be the headquarters in the middle, and there's going to be like a little quadrant in each corner for each person to have. Um, I think it's evenly spread out, and he's done a pretty good job with that. Um, I, think, I think these rooms are smaller. The biggest thing that I think is going to be so hard is having the walls as high as that. I think at a point we might have to just say like, it's just not happening because the walls are so intensive for resources. It's crazy. Um, so yeah, looks like we're going to go back into the jungle for more grinding. I'll catch you guys in a bit. Uh, actually, I'll show you how the grind goes down. So yeah, first thing I do is just look for some, you know, cheeky rocks that are poking out, even though it's much better to just slam a, uh, yeah, these things over here are ridden with rocks. All right, perfect. So, uh, oh, one more over here as well. Uh, so just grab the axe out and go through all these piles of rocks and, uh, passively build them at the same time. But it looks like we're running low on thatch and wood at the same time. Uh, let me just check my wood supplies. Uh, wood is very low. Thatch is not too bad, but wood's very low. So I'll just go over here and I'll craft them on the go because they are a lower weight volume when you actually have them fully crafted. So it's just like, might as well. And then I'll just like craft them as I'm like, you know, mining and whatnot. And yeah, so I'm gonna do this for about 10 more minutes, gather a bunch of resources, and I'll catch you guys in a bit. Okay, so this is me in my normal habitat, struggling around here. I'm trying to find, there it is, a bunch of stone that I dropped on the ground. I'm gonna go ahead and put these into walls. But as you can see, 15 ceilings, 11 walls. We're gonna make that hopefully close to um, 15 walls, but that'll be, yeah, 13 walls total. Can't move right now, encumbered, and then it goes away. Oh, it's not even going away right now. 
We're actually like maxed out materials. Like we've got so much wood on us. Oh, it's the flint. The flint just stacks up out of nowhere, man. It just it's just crazy. Could you go away, please? Mr. Wood, I, I would prefer if you just leave me alone. All right, we're going to go ahead and start placing some walls here to reduce our weight because it's, uh, yeah, better that way we can, you know, just kind of walk around. Oh, no, I failed! Ugh, I hate failing with the walls, please. I want to get all these done. I don't want to have to, at least I can break it and get some resources back, but at the same time, it's just so annoying. All right, yeah, so we're going to go for all these walls. I think we'll actually have the first layer of walls done. Like I said, I have no idea how we're going to get to the top and have this all the way done around, but it, it's just a lot of hard work. A lot of hard work. We'll uh, have to go down uh, to get this done. So yeah, we go. There we go. That was well. And I think that is a full complete, yeah, closed-in wall apart from the gates, which I think have their own special doors. So that'll be interesting. Uh, yeah, this right here. <laughs> Let's not talk about that one. We don't tell me all about that one. Uh, so yeah, you get half your resources back. It's not crazy, but the other one's just like replaced and I had to keep it there. All right, so <laughs> now we're down to, I don't know how I copped then. Uh, but yeah, now we're down to uh, the big bad ceilings. I think we're going to need more. Oh, for crying out loud, I see how I misclicked that one. It doesn't matter how bad we misclick, we won't even see it unless we go underneath it. But I think we're going to cover up so you'll never see. You'll never see what's underneath. I'm getting the hang of this now. I think I just had it glitched before. It was like being a mad jag. But now I'm just beasting through these floors. And uh, hopefully... Damn, I still need more. I still need so much more. I was thinking of making like metal all the way down or something. Something fancy. I guess we can do that kind of stuff later. We can just rip up the floor and put a new one down. It'd be easy. But yeah, we're going to need one, two, three, four, five, uh, so 23. I set out a goal and I will not leave until it's finished. I'm going to go ahead and we're going to finish this whole ceiling. I'm going to go back into the jungle. 24, 23 pieces. Alrighty, and we are crafting up our 23rd piece. Actually, it didn't take that long. It didn't time it or anything, but I think it was like 7 minutes. Um, we're actually getting a decent amount of level out of doing this as well. Nearly our second level coming into it, which will be 64. So almost 66, uh, 66, 65. And at 65, you actually get that awesome um, tranquilizer darts or something that you can shoot at guns. So that should be kind of interesting. But uh, I hope I didn't miscalculate here. Uh, now, if I mess up one of these, we're going back into the jungle. Like, I just see me fucking A with this stuff, man. Like, I just, I try so hard. And, ugh, I don't care. As long as I haven't died this episode, which I haven't. I didn't die last episode, I don't think. So, like, we're doing pretty well here on this, uh, this arc series, my bobber thinger. It just sucks I have to go back into the jungle. I call it the jungle, dude. You gotta go in. Oh, for fuck's sakes. I gotta go back again. All about that jungle hype, man. I'm just too much hyped right now, you know? Just too much hype. Too much hype indeed. All right, there's one there and one there. Okay, let's cut it down to the middle part. So one there. For fuck's sakes. I, uh, I had an even number then. Now I have to make... I failed. Did I fail three times? That's disgusting. All right. I guess... I, like, I can make this little quadrant piece here a little bit of metal. I wouldn't mind a little bit of metal. Um, so let's see. From the door, it's... It's three in, and from this door, it's two in. So, if I put one in one there, it wouldn't really make sense. So, I'd have to do it like, oh, either way, it won't work. I think we'll just go with uh, with, with stone for now. Just just to keep everything simple. And uh, now, let's go craft a bunch more of these things. It, it shouldn't take too long at all. Alrighty, there we go. Three pieces. What's the money that I will mess this up again? Alright, there we go. There we're good. I never want to do the ceilings again. They're good and perfect. There we go. Honestly, I think I've done a decent amount of work here um, for my first time on the job. I know he's done a lot of this stuff out the front, which I wanted to work on this episode, but I don't know if I have enough time to. I spent so much time getting all the pieces of wood and uh, stone to try and get everything up. But the ceiling's down, all that jazz. I think we'll paint everything blue and whatnot later down the line, so we're going to get some blue dyes hopefully rolling but uh yeah i wanted to do something else oh i wanted to make uh yeah that'll that'll take a day for today's building uh but yeah i wanted to get beaver here a uh a castroid oh, yeah they're called castroids but i wanted to get him a uh a saddle for himself so let me just see if it was actually within here or no it was definitely it's definitely over there come here come here buddy don't get caught gamble buddy mr beaver come here uh, also when i was messing around i was trying to like do grinds on like these railings and like i found out that if like 
you jump, it just continues your movement like that. It's like, I'm grinding, I'm no hand dropped a keyboard, I'm grinding. Alrighty, Mr. Beaver, let's make you a saddle. I swear, oh, I don't think I learnt it yet, actually. Saddle, and then down here, Casteroid. There it is, Casteroid. Looks weird, looks like a shotgun, bullet gun thing, whatever the hell that is. Alright, so, what do we need to make this bad boy here? What do we need? Saddles... And we need, oh, we need something, thatch, and a lot of it. All right, that's actually fine. I'll chuck all these resources back in here as well. Um, not that I haven't been, you know, lacking on the resource grind. I always want to make sure I'm not uh, just using Miola for a free pass here. I, I do my fair share of gathering resources, as you've seen. Um, all right, let's see here. Uh, I'm going to actually smelt up these as well while I'm waiting. I guess I have to put that in a fire. Uh, yeah, what are these down here? Uh, yeah, spoiled meat. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna need to put that up on a fire, so let's get some wood. I always forget to turn these things off, man. Oh, let's grab that metal out as well. Good amount of metal there, for sure. Uh, just topping off our already completely ridiculously full metal supply. Oh, I also wanted to throw this grenade the other day, because I want to try and clean up the smithy, but I guess we're gonna clean that up anyway. Um, oh, I gotta get my stuff from the other chest. But yeah, I wanna chuck a grenade and see what it's like. I wanna chuck this grenade up. I want to chuck a grenade. I want to chuck it at a dodo. Where's a dodo? Can I find a dodo, please? I want to find a dodo. I hate how the dinosaurs attack something all at once and then get bunched up like that. It's actually so annoying. Oh, I found myself a dodo. Oh, hello there, buddy. All right, how do I throw this thing? Uh -oh. Oh, oh, run away, Mr. Beaver. Run away, Mr. Beaver. Okay. Uh, question, que question, question. The, the grenade was here, but it blew up over here. I've been scammed. I have been scammed. There's no way around it. I've been scammed. You know what? I don't mind a uh, little beaver who needs a little bit of thatch. That's fine. That, that is totally fine for a saddle. At least it's not like obsidian, even though I've got so much of it. So, like, come the fudge right at me if you're going to be making out of obsidian. Um, all right. So, let's go ahead and chuck our thatchy boys in. And I'll chuck those hides in as well. And saddles. Casteroid. There we go. Uh, did we chuck the Arthur Pluris saddle in here? I think we, I thought I chucked it back in here. Yeah, there it is. Back there. Um, so, yeah. Hopefully, we're going to go back and try to get another one of those bad boys. Uh, yeah, that was kind of a face palm and a half what happened last time. So, hopefully, it won't happen again. All right. Primitive Casteroids saddle. Where are you, sweetness? Hello, dude. All right. You've actually got some levels on you. All right, let's get a little bit of movement speed. A little bit of health, movement. Wow, you actually got a lot of levels there. 44. Do you level up quick or something, buddy? All right, let's put on your saddle here. Oh, look at that cool little saddle you got there. All right, so let's see how far these guys go. I don't know why I cop then. All right, <laughs> these guys aren't too bad. Um, now, let's see what they're like in the water. I heard they're really fast. Yeah, they're right. Like, they're nothing crazy. I think they're faster than a shark. Um, that's cool. Now, do they have oxygen levels? Or Did anybody just see that? That was like a ramp underwater. So yeah, Mr. Beaver as a, uh, a tame I'd use a lot. <sighs> Not too sure. A little too slow for my liking. But uh, definitely a cool dude. And um, maybe maybe possible for the ocean. Maybe, maybe possible. Because um, he didn't seem to run away. But I don't know how that works. Maybe they get deeper and then they start to realize they need stuff. I'm not too sure. Um, but anyway, let's use please work here. What is our Quetzal doing? All the way over here. Oh, maybe when like... Dilo attacked me, it got involved. Like, don't get involved in that stuff, buddy. Alrighty, so I need like 30 XP to get a level up here, so uh, I'm not too sure what I can do to get this last little bit of level. I can probably just go and try and kill something. Um, but uh, either way, hope you guys did go. Oh, he tainted the Oma. Why would he do that? I wonder if they're good for harvesting something. I, I have no idea. Uh, but yeah, hope you guys did go on to enjoy this episode of. Arc Survival. Nearly said crazy craft there. Good one, Lachlan. But yeah, of course, if you guys did, let me know with a like rating down below. Oh, there's no bug repellent left. Oh, I'm going to have to plant those. No, I should be fine, though. All right, I'm really hoping this will give me the, the level. No. How much more XP? Wait, I wonder if I mine enough metal if I'll get it or not. Come on. Will I get it? Please? Please? Oh. There's a fierce Kano out here, boys. Let's go. A little bit of a boss battle to wrap it up, eh? Yeah, how do you like them apples? And that is a wrap. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys did, let me know with a like rating down below. I'll catch you guys next time. Bye, guys.